parsha is parsha mishpatim, and it has in it so many laws. But there's one that caught my eye this week, and it's about bullying and peer pressure. Peer pressure is a terrible thing because it's a group of people who try and convince you to do something that maybe you don't want to do, maybe something that's not good for you, maybe something that will do yourself harm. And bullying is pretty much the same thing, and that is when an individual tries to overpower you and say that their opinion is more important than yours and sometimes force you to do things that you certainly don't want to do. In this week's parsha in Perk Kaf Gimel, it says, Lo achare rabim liraot. Don't follow the majority to do bad. It's telling us that sometimes in life it's hard to overcome the pressure that our friends put on us. Sometimes they want us to do things that we know we shouldn't do. I remember often coming home and saying to my parents, I really want to do this. I want to go here. I want to be able to have this. And they would say, well, I'm sorry, you can't. And I would say, but all of my friends have it. You see, that is peer pressure. When everybody else is doing it, and you want to do it just because they have it, sometimes uh, that pressure becomes overwhelming. That's why the Hebrew word is so difficult, rabim. In this sentence, it says, lo achare rabim liraot. Don't follow the majority, but it also means don't follow the mighty. Sometimes we look up to people because we think that they're strong. And because they're strong, we want to be just like them. Rabim here in this sentence can mean mighty, and it also can mean many. Sometimes the force of an individual and the force of many people feels the same to us. It's hard to keep our own opinions and our own ideas when so many other people seem to think that we're wrong. Says the Torah in this week's parsha, trust yourself. Because you know what? You too were made in the image of God. And your opinion is important, just like theirs is. And the majority opinion only comes about when a lot of people get together with their individual ideas and say that together we think this is important. The rabbis of the Talmud say that we should make sure to follow the majority to do right. The rabbis of the Talmud say when there's a discrepancy and you don't know what to do, what you do is you follow the majority. That's what democracy is. Democracy is when we all get to vote and decide together the way our country is going to go. But you always have to make sure to put forth your own personal opinion. You have to make sure that in your life, your opinion is heard and never drowned out because you're afraid of somebody else. Says this week's Parsha, don't follow the majority to do bad, but make sure that if you have a good idea, that everybody gets to hear it. I hope this week you'll be able to have the confidence in yourself to be able to stand up for what you think is right, even in the face of many people or some who are just really strong who might say otherwise. Have a wonderful week. Kei o ta pedos, anon na shodon.